Darkstar here bringing you the ORL Grand Prix Division Number 2 Race 8 on Ladder Goat GP. As always, I'm giving a shout out to our sponsors, Fair Mods Custom Controllers, making sick ass custom controllers for the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3. Check them out. Now, a lot of you guys have heard me say, oh, I won't do a race video if there's like five drivers in the race, it's just going to be boring, blah, blah, blah. Well, this race is the exception. Only five drivers in this race, and they put on a show. Uh, so I'm showing you the whole thing. Uh, I hardly cut anything out. It's kind of a long video. Stick with me. Here's the start. Awesome starting gate there. No gate, just an explosion. It's kind of like a starting gun, but way cooler and it looks like Jake Bobius out to a lead followed by Street Killer 3 unrealistic uh, Frosted Arc and in last is Meta Carnax long straight away here get up to the Transforger's turn and Bobius through the hairpin first still with uh, Street Killer 3 unrealistic Frosted Arc and then Meta Carnax. Devil's Rejects, one, two, and three in this race so far. It's just the first lap. And it looks like Jake Bobius is gonna hold the lead for the first lap. Followed by Street Killer, Unreal, Frosted Arc, and Meta Carnax. Now I admit this race starts off a little bit slow, but trust me you guys, it picks up. This turn right here is one of my favorite turns on any track. It's an epic drift turn. Look at these guys just sideways through it. Looks like Unreal has gotten past Street Killer. Street Killer back in third place now. That's Jake Bobius. Unrealistic. Street Killer 3, Frosted Arc, and Metacarnax. second lap. They're starting to spread out a bit. Another look at that drift turn. Oh, Meta Carnax wrecks out. Recovers quickly. He's back on it. Still in last place, but he hasn't lost a whole lot of time. And they are way spread out now. Trust me, things are gonna change. This place, uh, this this race took place uh, this previous Saturday. GP2 racing Saturdays at 7 p.m. Eastern. Bobius has opened up a huge lead. Unreal still in second. Street Killer in third. Frosted Arc in fourth. Metacarnax in fifth. Superfly wearing the white armor with the red highlights. Kind of reminds me of me out there. Similar armor, same colors. The third, fourth, and fifth place are all really close together now. It's turning, it's turning into a battle for third. These guys are not giving each other room, and oh, all three of them go off the track. That's going to be a caution. All three came to a complete stop. And here we are at the caution line. Bobius in first. Unrealistic. Waiting on the rest of the pack. Here's Frosted Arc. Now we usually line up three wide. Frosted Arc has the option to take the uh, the front row outside, uh, but he chooses to take the second row inside instead. We'll see if that uh, that if that choice works out for him. So Street Killer Three is going to move up into the uh, the front row, and then Metacarnax back row outside. 
Should have taken the inside, probably, but... We'll see how it plays out. And that's a clean start. Unrealistic out in front. They are all right next to each other. Frosted are coming up on the outside. Giving Unreal a reason to worry. Oh, and Metacarnax and Jake Bogies both go off, both off their mongooses. That's going to be another caution. And here they are, racing back to the caution line. Frosted Arc in first. Unreal, then Street Killer. Takes them a minute to get set up. They're supposed to line up three wide. set up, ready for the restart. Now the official counts it down. There, there's, there's no visual start here. And that's another clean restart. Street Killer is rubbing up on Frosted Arc and loses a bunch of speed. Frosted Arc through the hairpin first, out in front, followed by Unreal. Metacarnax get, getting passed up by Street Killer on that turn. So it's Frosted Arc. Oh, Street's coming up fast on the outside. Frosted Arc still holding them off. Unreal and Street both right behind him. Metacarnax and Bobius fall back a bit. It's a three-man battle for first place. Frosted Arc drops back. Now it's Unreal and Street Killer. And Street moves up into first, Unreal in second, Frosted Arc in third. Into the hairpin. Street Killer manages to hold him off. Unreal getting up next to him. Now I'll be honest, Street Killer 3 had a terrible season last season. Uh, but I'm definitely going to say right now that he's probably the most improved driver in the ORL. Uh, I mean, he's holding up first place right here. Two awesome drivers right behind him. And he's holding them off like a pro. Uh, he's improved in leaps and bounds this season. Uh, and definitely deserves praise for that. Still holding off Unreal and Frosted Arc. Frosted Arc new to the league, but he's definitely got skills. A smart racer, a skilled racer. He's going to be a threat next season if he sticks around. Street Killer still holding him off. Oh, Street Killer slides out wide. Frosted Arc and Unreal slide by. Frosted Arc moves up into first. Street takes his spot back from, from Unreal. Back into second. Unreal in third. Metacarnax is making a move on Unreal. Now it's Metacarnax in third, Unreal in fourth, Bobby is fifth. Frosted Arc still holding the lead, followed by Street Killer. Metacarnax and Unreal side by side into the drift turn. And Unreal carries a ton of speed, moves up. He's got a bumper on Frosted Arc. They are pushing. Frosted Arc moves back in front of him. Now second place is three wide. Unreal, Frosted Arc, Meta Carnax. And Meta looks like he's got the edge. He's got it. He's got second. Unreal and Frosted Arc in third. But they are practically four wide. One, two, three, and four. They loosen up a bit. Street still in first. Meta Carnax up in second, Unreal in third, Bobius in fourth, Frosted Arc drops back to fifth place. Meta Carnax with a ton of speed through that turn, giving Street Killer a run. Can't quite take first place from him though. Street Killer is holding him off like a pro. Now Meta Carnax racing on Team Superfly all alone out there with three Devil's Rejects. And one independent. 
Metacarnax has missed a ton of races this season, but he is definitely sending the other drivers a message that he does belong here. Street Killer still in first. Metacarnax in second. Checkpoint reach. I told you guys this was going to turn Checkpoint into a race. Reach. You didn't believe me, but I was like, it's going to be a race. A street Killer in first, slides out wide. Metacarnax with the advantage, gets a bumper on him, takes first place. Street Killer fighting with him over it. Oh, Street Killer gets wrecked out. Completely off the track, no caution, only one driver wrecked. And Street gets left way behind. That sucks for Street Killer. I wanted to see him win. He's never had a, a, a win. Uh, this season yet, but then again at the same time neither is Meta and here's Meta in first place Racing for Superfly, Devil's Rejects right behind him That's Jake Bobius in second Unrealistic in third sliding out wide on that turn and Bobius and Meta are kind of separating themselves from the pack here but Meta is a skilled driver. Bobius is gonna have to work if he wants to uh, catch up to him and, and contest that lead. Met a little wide on that turn. Gives Bobius the opportunity to get on his bumper. Through the drift turn. Meta still holding off Bobius. This is a close race. Oh my god. Through the back chicane. Into the hairpin. Meta still has it. Bobius is right up on him. Unreal in third, Frosted Arc in fourth, and Street Killer dropping back way behind the pack in the last. That's a tough break for Street. It looked like he, he was going to own this race. Meta's still holding off the pack. Unreal's caught up to the group, but, but Unreal and Bobius get kind of tangled up on that turn and lose a bunch of speed. And Meta starts to break away from him. laps later, they've closed the distance on Meta, but Unreal and Bobius have got to drive like a team here if they, if they want to catch him. They're rubbing way too much, but they're definitely giving him a run for his money. It's a three-man race for, for first place at this point. Bobius right behind Meta Carnax. Hugging the inside, not giving these guys room. Into the front straight. Oh, Bobius makes a move on the inside. This is the last lap. He's got a bumper on Meta. He he's in front. Meta fights him off, pushes him out. Oh, and he's got the lead again. This is the last lap. Bobius is not going to let him win without a fight. Bobius is a really skilled racer. He's won several races this season. Meta Karnak's holding off the Devil's Rejects. All alone racing for Team Superfly. And it looks like he's got it. Meta Karnak's with his first ORL win. Can he hold it through the last turn? Here's the finish. Metacarnax in first, Bobia second, and Unreal in third. Metacarnax with his first ORL victory in two seasons. Now, granted, he's missed a ton of races, but uh, uh, now there's <laughs> Frosted Arc and Street Killer 3 bringing up the, the rear. Def last but definitely not least, here's the traditional GP race post race dog pile. Man, what a race. Like I said, you guys, only five drivers, but these guys put on a show. Uh, almost every single lap was loaded with action. Thanks for sticking around to the end, you guys. For those of you who did, I know this is a long video, but, uh, you know, I had to show as much of this as, as I could. It was an awesome race. race. So uh, thanks for sticking around. Thanks for watching. All that good stuff. Be sure to check out Fair Mods. Go ahead and sub to their channel. It's a sick channel. Check out their stuff. Uh, but that's it for today, you guys. Dark Star signing out. Peace. Put a little bomb in a hot ass damsel, blow stuff up and make people die.
Squishy. Squishy, squishy, squishy.